Okay, I'm officially mad about this whole Vox ad apocalypse thing. Hey you guys, it's comedian Michael Loftus from the Loftus Party. I gotta chime in. I was driving home, I was doing a show last night at a club, and it hit me just how stupid this Vox ad apocalypse thing is. Take a step back. You got Steven Crowder and Carlos Maza, whatever, literally fighting like fourth graders, like they are in elementary school, right? Like Steven Crowder's calling Carlos Maza a name, and Carlos Maza's like, stop it, stop it, and Steven Crowder calls him a name, and then Carlos Maza's like, stop it, stop it, I'm gonna tell a teacher, and that's what he did. He's like, Miss YouTube, Steven's making fun of me, and now Miss YouTube has to come over, Steven, were you making fun of him? I didn't do nothing, I just called him a name, he calls himself that name. But now everybody in the class is in trouble. This is exactly how it goes down in elementary school. Two little morons are going at it and then everyone in the class has to like put your nose in your books and don't eat like... I wanted to chew gum, I wanted to goof off, I wanted to have some fun. But now uh, Crowder and Maza have ruined it for everybody. Cause now YouTube is cracking down cause it's hate speech. It's hate speech. So they're just deplatforming people, ripping out people's uh, monetization, and they're taking down actually good videos. Videos that like teachers need to teach students about World War II. See, there's no way uh, our good teacher, Miss YouTube, can look at all the students in the class. Do you know how many videos there are on YouTube? It's insane. It's such a huge amount. Now they just have AI roaming around looking for trigger words and hate speech. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Taking words away from people to use is not going to make YouTube any better. It's supposed to be fun. It's supposed to be a good time. It's supposed to be informative. It's supposed to be entertaining. YouTube, you should just be a big giant warehouse of fun videos, of good videos. I do not care if Steven Crowder was teasing Carlos Maza. I really don't. And you know who else didn't care? That Okay, first, Carlos Maza didn't care, right? Here's a little tw tweet that he did. He's like, oh, there's this conservative YouTuber making answer videos and he's teaching. It's like a long-term relationship. So it was all good then. And then now, oddly enough, oddly enough, like in Gay Pride Week, he's like, it's too much, I can't take it. Which, dude, we know about the timing. This is like saying that a kid in your class doesn't believe in Santa Claus the week the, that, uh, it's the week before Christmas, right? <laughs> like, everybody's got Christmas on the brain, and you're like, Steven doesn't believe in Santa Claus. What? And everybody's supposed to flip out. Okay, this wasn't like an overwhelming amount of teasing either. I think it was like, what, seven videos over two years? Come on, come on. How many videos does Crowder upload? I, I, listen, I gotta think he's like every day, every day. And out of all those videos, seven were uh, dedicated to you, Maza? Grow a pair, I'm serious, grow up. Here's a lesson about the internet and about real life. Not everybody's gonna like you, okay? That's just how it is. If you can't go running to YouTube going, this guy doesn't like me, he's using hate words. Cut it out, cut it out. You're ruining it for everyone else. You're ruining it. Cause then, then I wanna know this. Then if we're gonna do this whole, he's using this, he's saying that, then what's to stop anybody from saying anything's offensive? Really, like what's to stop me from going, I think shark videos are, are, are horrible. When I see a shark video, I almost poop my pants. That's how terrifying it is. A shark video, ah! So then I get a bunch of people to sign a petition, stop putting up shark, and then we're ripped off. Then we don't get cool shark videos. And YouTube, listen, you guys need to get it together. Whenever somebody comes to you with some big petition or, oh, I've got 50,000 signatures saying that this is bad, you just got, you have to move on. You have to say no, you have to move on. There's only one kind of thing I think that YouTube should be monitoring for, literally. I'm, I'm being serious here. And that's when people are trying to organize violence. If somebody's on YouTube going, hey, we're gonna have a meetup next week, everybody bring your baseball bats, that kind of thing. You know, we're gonna go do some serious violence, guys. Stop that. And oddly enough, oddly enough, that's the kind of violence that uh, Carlos Maza was proposing. He's like, milkshake them all, make them, make them dread public organize. It's like, yikes. So hey, uh, let's stop tattling on one another. 
Let's use, let's put on our big boy pants, not everyone's gonna like you, in YouTube, to quote Nancy Reagan, just say no. Thanks for watching the video. I wanna thank all the Patreons. Like and subscribe. Hopefully I don't get demonetized for this.